Welcome right. back to United Gamers Authority. I am Shade Hunter. I'm Phantom Stag. And we're full of technical difficulties. Oh, you have no idea. Well, I'm not going to delay it. We've we've been busy. I'm, I'm just going to switch in here. So we've got all kinds of decoration done in row room. We have completely sealed it off. We have air coming in just in case we get a radiation storm. I don't know if this planet gets those, but just in case. Um, this whole base is actually sealed now. We've got our kitchen moved over here. Phantom's done a pretty good job of getting all this set up. Looks really good. I tried to make it look like it was actually usable. I think I managed it. Yeah. I mean, we could still sit on the benches. <sighs> There's that. Yes. Then out here is our... It's not complete because we've got these cubby holes that can have some things put in there, but we don't have the CPU power really to do much of anything else. So, not yet. Yeah. We're we do have here. a second... Advanced constructor and a deconstructor. I mean, we even went on a mining mission. We went and got a ton of cobalt. We got um, Neo and all of that footage, like four, four or six hours of recording gone because it was all black. I, I, I can't use it. I, I don't know what happened. It was it was kind of sad. Yeah. Um. So all the things we wanted to show you about what we were doing, you just have to take our word for it. Yeah, there's... Uh, here, we'll start up here in the living area. Did some decorating up here. It's it's a little on the dark side because we're not done, but we got some paint done. That's pretty much all I've done in here. Did you actually put furniture in yours? Oh, yeah. Uh, yes, yeah, some. I haven't painted it, but I've got some furniture. So. Oh, cool. And he's even got a bathroom going on over here. Awesome. Oh, I need to wash off that radiation that I had, apparently. From that planet where we're glad the Xerox, Xerox have really, really bad aim. Oh, yes. A really bad aim. Because those three rockets would really hurt. Actually hit something vital. Oh, I'm going all the way down. Do the... Decorated the mechanical level, and we could even expand the base down there because initially we had that as our mining and mining stone area. Um, I don't know. We could add rooms Back in the and day. stuff. Yeah, <laughs> we could <laughs> add rooms and stuff down there. We could, but um, we're still using very little power. I went ahead and doubled the generators just in case, and the water is encroaching in here. What the heck? That wasn't oh, like that earlier. That's weird. That's. I don't know. It's really annoying. Anyway, so we're still pulling decent power. With, with the solar it is going down but we've done we, we just got done doing a stupid amount of crafting so we had we had the deconstructor going and all four of the other constructors going because we were building so much and we'll show you that in a minute it's on the other side of our entryway there it's it's nuts we also have our full medical suite over here And then we're going to go outside. Um, yeah. There's that big thing sitting there. We chose the Janos because we could slowly upgrade it over time. And that's what we were doing. We were going out, getting the materials, and getting this thing in. It was relatively cheap to make to be able to bring in because it didn't have any thrusters, didn't have any guns. I think it only had like one constructor. Um, it was mostly just a shell. Yeah. And we took out the small ship 
and the miner, and we went and got all kinds of stuff. We're nearly out of material now. We actually need to do a lot of things to continue on this. <laughs> yeah. Um, resupply. Seriously resupply. So we have three... We may actually have enough material to put in another generator. We might actually need it. I don't know. I haven't actually tried flying this thing right now. So we'll see what happens when we go to take off. We have a jump drive. We have gravity, which, I mean, those things we had to make. We had to make the contaxid tank. We don't have shields yet. We had to make extra fuel because this thing comes with abysmally small fuel tanks. So I had to add the fuel tanks in. Um, yeah, it's crazy. We had to make all this, all the medical suite in here. Let's see here. It only had one small generator, so I had to make more generators. It only had the one constructor. These are only large constructors because on the basically on the road, we're not going to be making too much. So I mostly processing we'll just... ore, that sort of thing. Yep. So we've got our input and our output. Eventually, this spot will have a deconstructor. So it's got our deconstruct spot there. And then our mined materials there. Yes, this already has a miner on it. It's not a, one of the laser ones. It's got awful big. And then we got the ammo bay. We've got four guns on it. Right now, it's got room for, I think, eight more or something like that. The thrusters are actually just the large thrusters because we don't have the materials to be able to make the advanced ones. These All these spots are made for the advanced thrusters. Um, but we do have enough thrust to be able to get going. We've got essentially thrust in all directions. We can manage. And there's the giant nose. And right now it's actually covering up the exit. This, uh, the Genos is actually a module. It can dock with the Helos module or modular uh, carrier or the space stations that take the same things. So I'm actually thinking maybe we'll uh, use one of those space stations at some point and maybe bring in the actual Helos carrier. I think that'd be cool. But we are actually getting ready to take off. We are wanting to raid the different locations around the map, completely raid them out, and eventually also mine out all the resources on this beginning planet. And before we leave, we also want to kick Xerax off this planet. They've got oh, yeah. a couple of small places, so we're going to need to get a bunch of materials together to get a an actual proper fighter ship and maybe a tank, but we probably won't need the tank. Yeah, I want to actually mine out everything and also continue the quest. Speaking about quests. Yeah. I did actually go through and pick up the engineer and start that and finish it. And I showed how it was done, but it was all black. So, yeah. We're, yeah. So let's see if I can actually show you what I got. Um, I don't even know if I can. The log. Yeah, there's a bunch of bonuses to everything, to mining the tools and everything. I, I have no idea what the... I don't know if I can actually see it again. I'll have to look into it and let you guys know what those bonuses are. But let's see if this uh, beast can take off. We did do some adjustments because right behind here is where the original uh, elevator was, but it was right in front of one of those in those generators that basically cooked you and fried you with radiation every time you walked near it. Like right down here. 
but this also has a little bit of a kitchen instructions on how to upgrade it and we've even got our farm going in here which looks like it's a couple things are ready to harvest we've got spots for all the different cores that we're going to be using so this is the normal way you would get out of this but fortunately that grill is in the way moment it won't be for long well until we <laughs> can actually get the laser drills on here and get the core upgraded we do have the cpu basic extender right there yeah let's uh right now we're gonna go after the abandoned outpost i want to take that one on i'm gonna And Theta Labs, we've got two Theta Lab installations on this planet. Yep. Those look like fun. So I'm going to have it mark it, but it's going to remove when we show up. So we've already got all of our food ready and everything set to go. So we can just. And I don't believe that the drill works in atmosphere. Yep. CV drills do not work in atmosphere. That's kind of a bummer, but I get it. And it's interesting if you if you go into uh, view mode and look down, this ship is as big as the base. The yeah. footprint is almost identical. That's to the footprint of the base. Very large. Oh. So our um, our hangar is going to have to be pretty large and probably have a very large. Um, landing pad on top of it so we're gonna have to get more stone which we'll get mining asteroids so that. yep oh looks like power's okay hey, it flies and hours and under stats we still have thrust in all directions we don't have re too much remaining thrust going forward backwards and side to side but the down we definitely have plenty so let us it's gonna be slow it's it's not it's not gonna be very fast on planets unless I'm trying to go up if you find yourself needing to get somewhere quickly but you're the ship you're in just isn't cutting it can actually exit the planet and then fly over where you're going because there's no gravity or friction base. Uh, wow, I massively overshot it behind us. Well, you could continue the direction we were going and hit Theta Labs. <laughs> well, this is like... But I actually yes. didn't massively overshoot. Not that bad. Yeah, a little bit. Not too bad. You know what? I don't think I've actually been in this outpost. I'm not sure that I have either. It doesn't look super familiar. All right. So, uh, say hi to the locals. Yeah, let's go see who's home oh geez hi something uh turret right underneath that overhang yep ouch That's uh, that's what it was. It's what the uh, ship was shooting at earlier. Now we know. All right, hang on. Let me uh, let me see if I can actually see it with one of the guns. We can use a ship gun to, to take it out. That could be useful. All right. 
Uh, which one to do? Okay, signal logic is still. Uh, turrets, turrets, turrets. I don't know which one was placed first and which one was last. Oh, hang on. Yep, I can see the gun. Done. At least that turret's done. I might want to actually heal. Why on earth would you want to do something like that? <sighs> All right, there we go. Oh, I should probably also get something to pop me up. Where are you at? Um, off to one side. Other side of the ship from you. Okay. See uh, me. Hang on. Now I've got, like, everything super loud. It was, like, drowned out by the ship, and... Right. I was circling around to the side to see if I could get an angle on it. I wasn't able to, but... Didn't I turn the turrets off? Oh, I got in when it used it. I don't know what it was shooting at, but... I'm not sure he... Oh! Spiders. Ah! Oh. Put the ramp down and one started trying to climb in. So, I shot it. All right, so well, let's go towards the blinking red light. That's always a safe bet, right? Yes. Mm, here comes Mork down that ramp in the middle. Come on, yeah. jerk off. Come on. I hate spiders. I can reach the genos from here, so I'm just going to dump into the deconstruct box. I'm going to link to it and see if I can just stay there. So apparently nothing to use in here. So I guess I'll go check on this other side as well. Radiation, that's always fun. Here's the elevator. Yep. This is the main hall. Oh, 
Oh, shh. Right turn. Nice. This is bad. This is bad. Well, I found where it wants us to be. Ouch. Parasite. Do we have any? Wait, is that a dermal parasite? Let me check the medical. Endo parasite. All right. Uh, I cannot reach Janos from here. All right. I go have to. Oh jeez. There's blowing up plates all over the place in this one. Deconstruct, I said I was going to put stuff in. That's where you said you were going to put it, yeah. Uh, endoparasite. You know what? Let me just go get rid of it like the machines. I don't want to use up our limited medical. If I don't get rid of it, then it'll just end up killing me. So. <sighs> That easy? Alrighty, I'm gonna organize this stuff and then we'll see where we're at. Alright, so what we've got going on here, on the input we have all the components and everything that we picked up. It's a decent amount. Um so let's go item type. There we go. Um, there's a few things that don't belong in here. Ooh, ooh, here and there. But so you have one fridge for medical, one fridge for food. I guess I'm putting all the raw food in the food. Yeah. All right. Because we'll at the moment, later. that's that's the way it's set. So input got a bunch of components output we've got a few things that we want to hang on to like the hydroponic steel dual fuel cells um, concrete blocks and wireless um i don't know what happened to my salvage core i think it busted i can make another one later though uh those don't go in here all right so we've got a bit of things a bit oh it's on my bar my bad all right output let's go ahead and drop that for there then over here in the deconstruct this is all the all the things that we were able to pick up that will just be deconstructing me back. Oh, there's a fridge in the deconstruct box if you want to grab it and put it in there in the kitchen area. Okay. 102 container extensions. Good nice. grief. Um, and we did not get any mine material there. Nope. We got a bit of stuff. It wasn't nearly what I wanted, but again, It's uh, beginning base or beginning world. So let's go take on this Theta Labs now. Mm -hmm. 